make me beautif beautiful uh -huh. through photo editing, maybe, I don't know. So how long have you done this and what do you eat on a daily basis? Yeah, so I've, I've been basically fully carnivorous for a year now. And so basically it's mostly just steaks and hamburgers and stuff like that. So do you have any side effects? <laughs> uh, yeah, the side effects are I got a lot healthier. So that would, if you call that a side effect. We need to get you talking about a little, just about working out. I mean, I know the film's not about working out, but you know, we're gonna get you sure. working out. So just how to stay healthy and what you do right. and whatever. Okay. Yeah, so I think, you know, just when you approach health in general, I think diet is a huge component of that. We have to, you know, get our diet sorted out. But I think there's some other things that are important, and one of those is exercise. If you eat a highly vegetable protein-based diet, you're going to have more putrefication in your colon than you would with an animal-based diet. So that's, you know, a total myth about meat rotting and putrefying in your intestines. Perfect. I think we're good. To go. Yeah, not bad. I didn't pull any muscles. I'm not too slow for an old guy, so. <laughs> you know, time for a protein shake, or huh? Time for a protein shake. A protein or? steak, man. <laughs> oh, we're gonna go get some burgers. Uh, looks like uh, about two pounds of these uh, burger patties are gonna hit the, hit the spot. How you doing, man? Hey, can I get 16 just plain patties by themselves? 16 plain patties with. Salt or no salt? Uh, you can put some salt on there. Not no problem. Let me make sure I can run that through real quick, okay? Okay. Yeah, it's kind of funny. You go, you go to some of these places and, yeah, I mean, you know, the first cash register can't figure it out, then the sec second cashier comes up, and then the manager comes up, and then they finally figure it out, so. I've even had to call in advance sometimes. They're so used to, it's so unusual to go in a fast food place and just order burger patties because everybody orders fries and Cokes and, and the buns, and that's what's making everybody fat and sick. You know, but when you come in there just eating burger patties, they look at you like you've got, you know, a third eyeball on your head. Hello, I have an animal pie, a medium poke light ice with a lemon. Nope. So 16 meat patties, no bun or anything, Correct. and water. That's it. 1584, please. Thank you. Sorry about that. Thank you very much. Hi, how are you? Do you like any ketchup? I'm sorry? Uh, no, that's the 16 patties, is that right? I'm sorry, what? That's six, 16 burger patties in there, right? You didn't have an animal fry? No, I had 16 burger patties. Hmm. Hey, don't mess up our, our meat, man. <laughs> I appreciate it. Okay, Enjoy. thank you. Okay, we'll do it. Right. Okay, this stuff. Time to eat. So this is unusual for you, or? It's typical. This would be a normal meal. <laughs> Delicious. Is it good? Alright. Yeah, man. Bad man or something like that. Are there any? Okay. When I was on like a low carb or ketogenic diet, I was constantly wanting to make those ketogenic desserts because I had quite a sweet tooth. And that was always something that, uh, you know, you were always looking forward to that next hit of sweetness. And so you'd put all these artificial sweeteners in there. You know, with this diet, I mean, all that goes away. You don't even, you really, you could put a, the best dessert in the world right in front of me and I wouldn't even think about eating it. When you fill up on, you know, just pure nutrition like this, your, your desire and your cravings for other food pretty much disappear. How was it? Uh, delicious. Two pounds of goodness down the hatch. Testing audio, we're talking about 
eating meat. 